would make a blog since I'm sitting at home um, working on my dissertation, so uh, no time like the present to procrastinate. Um, you may notice on my little whiteboard, I'm still using it. Look at all them green and red marks crossed off. Booyah! That's right. I'm making progress, sort of. Um, but now I'm actually making a blog, so I guess that's like the antithesis of um, progress. And that's a $5 word. It's the opposite of progress. Um, other than that, uh, it's going well. Um, we had a mishap where my laptop got Carnation Instant Breakfast spilled on it. And apparently that does not mix with um, computers and software. So I may have lost um, some of my data, which really isn't that big of a deal. Um, I can get it back um, pretty fast when it comes to working with data sets. Um, but it's just kind of a bummer because that's the computer I have um, my statistical package on. So now I have to go to Ames whenever I want to uh, do analysis Cs. I don't really know which one you're supposed to use with that. Um, so other than that, right now I'm working on my lit review. Um, I'm going to the Cephal website a whole bunch. If anyone doesn't know what that is, that's the Center for um, Center for Social and Emotional. Oh, what the hell? Here, I'll just open the website up and y'all can look at it. The Center on the Social and Emotional Foundations of Early Learning. Great website. Um, it has lots of interesting stuff about how children develop socially and emotionally. Um, lots of interesting research, and uh, if you're ever, if you're a parent, or you're just interested in kids um, and what role social and emotional development plays um, in their, you know, learning and just how they develop, it's it's a great website. Lots of information. So, anyways, I've transitioned from an office chair to a um, Swedish exercise ball today because. I felt like I really needed something to um, get me going, so that's my, my boost. Um, as you can see, lots of empty cans, lots of messiness around my desk. Um, but I'm moving along, so I guess I can have a little bit of mess if I'm, if I'm making progress. So um, My dogs are helping me quite readily. I'll show you the other dogs, what they're doing. It's a Thursday, by the way. So... There's Carl. Say hi, Carl. He's hard at work. He makes sure the carpet doesn't blow away. There's Murphy. Say hi, Murph. Kinda. Oh, Carl's up. That's a rare occurrence that he gets up and walks around. Say hi, Carl. He seems to like you guys. So... Anyways, that's it. Oh, other also, um, I've got uh, <coughs> I got what do I want to say confirmation. Um, so my article did get published in the Journal of Early Childhood Early Child Healthcare. Um, so I'm technically a published research author. Um, I was the first author on it, so I'm pretty excited about that. Um, I think that's about it. Still eagerly awaiting to hear from Jobs. Um, so. Stuff moves slow in academia when it comes to employment and stuff. So um, every time my phone rings, my heart gets all fluttery, and I'm like, "Oh man, I wonder if that's for me." You know, I wonder if that's a job. And so um, inevitably, it's always like a, a salesperson trying to sell me something. So I end up getting really pissy with them and I'm like, "No, I don't want to buy that," and hang up the phone. So, um, anyways, that's it. I uh, hope everyone has a good day, and I'll blog back later. Bye. Oh. Before I blog back, um, way to go, you and I, Panthers. I haven't said anything about this on the um, on uh, on my blog, but they beat the number one team in the nation um, on a huge three pointer. Uh, you may or may not know Elaine and I are huge basketball fans. We have season tickets, and you know we go to all the stuff. We listen to the radio, and um, so we were pumped. We were beside ourselves. We ended up ordering pizza and drinking the rest of the night. Um, they play Michigan State in two days. Big game. Um, I didn't get to go to the send-off because I was at Iowa State, but Elaine told me the send-off was really cool. Um, so good luck to them. No matter what they do, wow, what an accomplishment. And, you know, I've had some of them in class, and it's just, you know, it's great. So 
lot of notoriety to our small little town in northeastern Iowa. So, anyways, um, that's it. Watch the game. Root for the Panthers, unless you're in Michigan State, Lansing. Then I guess you can root for uh, Michigan State. But if you're anywhere else, you better be rooting for the Panthers because, uh, you know, they're the underdog. Um, so, anyways, have a good day. Bye-bye.